Right, the next thing I... Oh, oh yeah, that's match with Miz, okay. Let's see what kind of match this is. Oh, just a regular match. Just a regular match with the Miz. Break down the walls! Right, oh, single match, okay. Oh, flying forearm! Come on, Jericho! I mean, Miz! Oh, knife edge chop he was going for. He Mids countered it. Has the arm. Oh, and I countered it. Sweet. Oh, what's he going for here? Suplex. Chris oh, Jericho nice. A Bit of a delay. Delay suplex there. That's pretty sweet. Oh, Jericho. Oh, head, squeezing headlock. down on the head. Oh, Chris Jericho headlock getting more over. aggressive by the second. Miz is in trouble. That chop between his chest and deep purple. Oh, what's he going for? Oh, this is this is a uh, vintage Jericho, as Michael Cole would say. Oh, Jericho into the headlock. What now? What move has he got here? Oh, oh an eye rake. The okay. That's such an effective move. Uh, another headlock takeover. Oh, I think Mr. is about to counter. Yep. The Luthes press. And would you Luthes look at those shots? press by the Miz. That'll do some damage. Come on, Jericho. Ow. That hurt, Miz. Ow. Miz into oh. the tie up. Tie up, tie up, tie up, tie up. Oh, I got the better of it, sweet. Oh, damn it, I just went the same direction. Look at the eyes of Jericho. Shit. He's relishing this assault. And he hits the drop. Oh, drop what impact. Oh, Woo! I can feel that one out here. Jericho. Another oh, eye. Oh, he's going that's such an effective move. What's going to happen now? Oh, back suplex. What an incredible oh. suplex. Jericho going for here. Oh, drop kick to the face. Son of the Miz. Thought maybe shut his mouth up. Oh, there oh. it is. Flying oh, forearm. Oh, forearm. From the ring to the floor. Oh, what's Jericho going for? Springboard. Body splash. Sweet. Right now, his speed's been neutralized. So what he has to do is figure out a way to pick up the pace. Oh, it's, just, oh, it's the backbreaker thing. Through. I'm not sure what he called Double Underhook Backbreaker, I think he might call it. I think that's what it could be called. Oh, punch straight to the face. Oh, and a kick! Oh my god. Oh yeah, we'll go for the uh, the Bulldog. Oh! Let's spin him round. We'll go for this thing. Oh shit, I forgot to turn my status off. Oh, look, the Lion Salt! Lion Salt! This wall's a Jericho type now. Go for the walls, baby! Ah, he's got it! Tap, miss! Tap! Ah, he's tapping out. He couldn't Jericho handle it. He couldn't wins. handle that. It'd be good if you had the Lion Tamer as well. That'd be pretty sweet. i never seen that. Here's your winner, Chris Jericho! Weren't tables. <laughs> it's a regular match, so sorry. Right, next thing was Gene Okerlund, right? I see he was on the WWE app like before, that, that, that WWE app exclusive video things. Well, he was on it, and oh my god, he looked terrible. His eyes and that were all weird and that. He just looked absolutely terrible. Oh, well, look, just Jericho civilian. Okay, cool. Last week, should I take it you've developed an interest in the United States Championship? Did you actually listen to what? a word of what I said last week? Huh? The United States Championship is not my style, Stephanie. All I want is the WWE Championship. Well, Chris, I'm sorry to hear that. After what you did last week, I had put you in a United States Championship match tonight against Kofi Kingston. But if you're not interested, I guess I'll just have to make it non-title instead. Good luck out there, champ. Oh, what the fuck, Stephanie? You bitch. Yeah. Yeah, Gene Oakland, he really didn't look good. His, his eyes not look very, like, droopy and stuff. It just looked really bad, in my opinion. 
But uh, we'll see what TV has to say. Boston for Monday Night Raw. It's Decent Michael Beth. Cole and Jerry the King Lawler at ringside. And have we got a packed show tonight. Last week, Chris Jericho picked up the win over Santino. But it looks like just winning wasn't enough. Jericho set out to make a statement at Santino's expense. But all he ended up doing was attracting the attention of the United States champion, Kofi Kingston, instead. Jericho also roughed you up a little in the process, didn't he, Michael? I'd rather not talk about that. Thanks. Oh, yeah, he really must have been hurting from that little holding on to his jacket. Fucking hell, Cole. Right, the next thing, oh, yeah, was Mark Henry squashed Zack Ryder. That was a joke. It was over in like less than 30 seconds. It was so unnecessary. I don't see the point in their matches. Like with Mark Henry and that. They just come out and just squash. What's the point? It doesn't make them look strong in my opinion. That just looks stupid. What's going on? Anything else going on here? Oh, okay. What happened last week, Beth? Losing to Kelly? <laughs> Very funny. We'll see how many jokes you make after I dump you on that little blonde head of yours tonight. If Ooh. the Glamazon wants to talk about things that are dumpy, let's talk about the Glamazon's butt. Just for what? that, I'm gonna take my time and really punish you before I pin you. So she has a dumpy butt? What the fuck does that even mean, Maurice? Ah, oh, just disparaît. Get lost. Okay. Oh, who's that? Hornswoggle in the mess? <laughs> Give me back my wallet, Hornswoggle. Do you have a pot of gold somewhere? Why do you need my six bucks in sushi coupons? Ah, money, 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 money! <laughs> bye, 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 bye! Get out of there, you little magical mutant! <laughs> Is he gonna pick up his wallet or what? Maybe I can steal it. Yeah, I can. Ah, I stole it, sweet. Thanks. I owe you a latte or some backup if you ever need it. Oh, what? Oh my god, I got 50 SP for giving Miz his thing back. Huh. Let's see if he went in here. Hey, Swoggle, what are you? Swoggle? Okay, he disappeared. Okay, that was a bit weird. But yeah, I don't see a point in that squash matches. They're like, it's like happening on Raw all the time. Like, let 30 second minute to a minute matches, boom, and that's it. And it was. The Zack Ryder was just getting treated so badly. And he had on these, this awesome ring gear and it said, Push me on the back. That was pretty awesome. And he actually sent out a tweet to, to Vince McMahon saying, What do you think of my new trunks? And then a picture of Push me. Thought that was pretty awesome. And then the next thing was. What was it? Oh, yeah. It was Brodus Clay and Tensai against 3MB in Honky Talk Mamas in the Brodus and Tensai's corner. And as you may have guessed, another squash match. And then afterwards, uh, Honky Talk Man smashes Heath Slater with the guitar. So unnecessary. Why are they putting... 3MB could be a really good uh, stable, but they just keep... Uh, wasting them in stupid matches like that. And the same with Bros and Tensor, they're really good, but they're just getting put in stupid matches like that. But uh, we'll talk to Triple H, see what he says. Well, if it isn't the non champ himself, why don't you just cut the baloney and listen, Hunter? I may have a match with Kofi tonight, but as soon as I'm finished with him, I'm coming for you. Chris, when you lost to me, you went to the bottom of the heap. I have a long list of contenders. I can't give you a shot every week. Be grateful for what you've got. A match with a United States champion is more than you deserve. <laughs> I mean, personally, I'd have stuck you competing for the hair metal karaoke championship. Oh my god, Triple H, that was just fucking hilarious. Well, if uh. it isn't the non champ himself. Oh, come why don't on. You just cut the baloney and listen, Hunter. I may have a match with Kofi tonight. But as soon as I'm finished with him, I'm coming for you. Chris, when you lost to me, you went to the bottom of the heap. Mm -hmm. I have a long list of contenders. I can't give you a shot every week. Be grateful for what you've got. A match with a United States champion is more than you deserve. <laughs> I mean, personally, I'd have stuck you competing for the hair metal karaoke championship. <laughs> Hilarious, Hunter. <laughs> Piss in my pants, Hunter. Right, next thing is The Undertaker is facing CM Punk. 
at WrestleMania. That is going to be really good. I'm interested in that. And apparently, on I was reading some things, like there's rumors and that, but apparently Undertaker once... Did you see once... Kane earlier? It sounded like someone backed out on their match with him, and he wasn't very happy about it. Backed out? Hmm. Must be a coward with no honor. Now Santino, he is a man of honor. A brave man of honor. That's great news. I'll let Kane know that you'll take him on tonight. Don't! <clears throat> I mean, don't wait around here. You go set it up. And I need to get ready to unleash my fist of fury on... on Kane. Okay. You are so brave, Santino. You trying to impress a girl, Santino? Because I can think of a few things that would impress her more than getting wheeled out of the ring on a stretcher. Kane is big and red. Like a fire truck. And the fire in my heart is one he cannot put out. Oh my god, how cheesy was that crap? Don't you have to be somewhere else, like, not up all in my grill? <laughs> oh, he speaks so much crap, Santino. Yeah, Punk Taker. Apparently Undertaker wants Punk to, to win. Now, I don't know if this is true or just a rumour or not, but apparently that's what he wants. But I'm not sure. It's going to be a really good match, I know that. But I, I don't know if he should win or not. Does Stephanie get say anything or? What the fuck are you doing, Stephanie? Don't you have some place okay. you need to be? She just shoved that phone up her ass. Probably taking a picture of her Triple H. But yeah, that should be a really good match. It'll definitely be brilliant. They've had, they had good matches before, back in uh, like 2009, was it their feud? So we'll see what happens. See how that goes, turns out. Santino versus Kane. <laughs> yeah, it is actually happening. Okay. Uh, yes, I do. Jericho versus Kobe Kingston. This will probably be another easy match. I could have been the US champion if, if uh, Jericho had shut his mouth. <laughs> oh, we'll see this since he's got a title. Boom, boom, boom. From Ghana, West Africa, weighing 221 pounds, he is the United States champion, Kofi Kingston. What the hell is he doing? Hear them shouting! Oh shit, go ahead, Rob. Oh well. Alright, now. Hey. Break down a wall! Right, this be beat Kofi Kingston's ass. Oh yes, shoulder to the post. Boom! Oh, the game's not going to it. I couldn't resist coming out to watch Jericho find yet another way to lose. The guy's huh. an Imogen, really. The guy's a what did he say? The guy's an Imogen. No idea what he said. Oh, counter, sweet! You're going up on top, Kingston. Over the back suplex. Uh... My volume up on my headset a bit. Just in case J uh, Triple H says anything else, he's speaking rather low there. Oh, what's this? Big oh! To the back of the skull. Not sure what that's called, like sleeper hole drop or something? I'm not sure. Yeah, it's just in the other direction as well. One more time. Right, what's the bottom one? Oh! Oh! Black suplex! Sweet. Destroying the back of uh, Kingston here. This may be a non-title match, but Jericho doesn't appear to be holding anything back. Well, what's this? Maybe he should, though, Michael. At least on the hairspray. Look at his bangs. It, it's like he's part porcupine. Where's animal control? That'll cause some damage. It's like Jericho he's Pokemon. Has the Fucking speak up, uh, Triple H. Grab the hole. Oh, was that a brain buster? It's pretty sweet. Uh, oh, yeah, the, the styles clash. Oh, he countered it! Damn it. 
How's he doing? It's not a million dollar fish. What are you doing that for, oh, you fat? Oh! Oh, T Bone Suplex! Sweet! Come on. Styles clashed. Yeah, it's working this time. Spin him around. Spin him around. Yeah! Code breaker time now. Jericho! Boom. It's over now. I could be the US champ if Jericho had not been a ferret. And Jericho picks up the win. Woohoo! I win. Slowly but surely, it looks like Chris Jericho is starting to shake his bad luck off. But just think, Jericho hadn't been so arrogant. He could have been walking out of here the new United States champion. I know. I'm sure that fact isn't lost on Jericho, King, but whichever way you look at it, a win over the United States champion is definitely a big deal. Triple H not going to say anything? He was out on commentary. Hmm. Well, there you go. What's that? 